Hi everyone, I'm going to show you how you can access Seesaw using the new home learning code option provided by your teacher. So if you are on a laptop or desktop device, you simply need to go into Google and search Seesaw. Alternatively, if you are using a tablet device, you will need to click on the Seesaw icon, which looks like this. So I'm going to click on the first Seesaw link and it will take me to the Seesaw homepage. From here, I'm going to click on the login button on your top right. Now, when you get to the Seesaw login page, you need to click on I'm a student, which is the middle option. Now, this is the student sign in page. There are a few options that you can choose Today we're going to focus on the text code option or the scan code option. On the home learning code sign-in sheet that your teacher would have provided you with, which looks something like this, there are a few options. Now this is a sample student's home learning code for privacy reasons. Now if you look at number three, you will see the text code. So I'm going to copy that Alternatively, if you are on a tablet device, you can click or you can scan the QR code just here. So I'm going to come back to the text code box and paste in the text code from my home learning sheet. And it will log me into the class page. Now on the left, you can see a list of all the activities that the teacher has assigned for me. On the right, your journal is where your activities will be posted once your teacher approves them. Inbox is where your teacher can send you messages and the activities, again, are what your teacher assigns for you. Now, if once you do a complete an activity, so I might go into this one, for example. Now, once you have completed the activity using the four options, which are text, or typing, recording voice, taking a photo, and then adding shapes or backgrounds. You just need to click on the green tick on your top right, and that will upload that and send that straight to your teacher for approval. Once he or she has approved it, it will come up in your journal. I hope that helps today. If you have any other questions, please don't hesitate to contact me and I hope you have a great day.